Hi, this is Jesse from ERA and you are watching Loudwire. I first started playing guitar when I was 12 and the first song I learned was Smoke on the Water, which I am not gonna bore you by playing that song. We've all heard that riff. <laughs> no one needs to hear that riff right now. I didn't really get into guitar for about a year after owning one. Got into it when I figured out tabs because something about being able to just see the numbers and learning a song by a band that I listened to was like crazy for me. It was like a huge revelation in guitar playing for me. The chords were boring, tabs were fun. And the first thing I learned was um, this Blue Oyster Cult riff. Through the Reaper. I pretty quickly started gravitating towards the metal stuff. I seem to have more fun and want to stick with the guitar more when my fingers are moving more, so Metallica, you know, pretty, pretty obvious one. I, uh, I got the Kill 'em All tab book and I was really stoked um, on this song, Seek and Destroy. <laughs> So most of uh, what I do in my bands is drop tuning, and I still remember the first song that I learned in drop tuning, which was kind of a big big day for me. Uh, it was from this band called Meeling and Sons of Disaster. They were from Birmingham, which is where Era is from, where I'm from, and um, they were kind of hometown heroes. They were quite a bit older than us, and I thought this was the sickest riff in the world. <laughs> Um, yeah, so drop tuning, once I learned that, it was all over. Um, and then I got into Asley Dying, Kill Switch Engage, All That Remains, just that sweet golden age of metalcore, and that completely just shaped the way that I wrote guitar. That was the most I ever played guitar in my life, and the most fun I ever had was during that during that timeline where I got into Kill Switch and Asley Dying specifically. This riff particularly from Asley Dying from the song Elegy, me and my friends thought it was the sickest song. <laughs> Uh, a lot of a lot of low tunings. Um, we play seven string guitars, and the first band that really that really made that click for me that showed me that you could be cool and tasteful and be tuned low as shit was Deftones. Um, the Diamond Eyes record in 2010 was huge for me. Pretty sure they're on eight strings. They're playing in like F F sharp D sharp, really low stuff, and. Uh, yeah, a riff I really liked was uh, this riff in You've Seen the Butcher. And there's also uh, this one that I really like off of Corno Yokan called Poltergeist. I would say Deftones is probably the band that stuck with me the most from all that stuff that kind of got me into the way that I write now and they still remain one of my top five favorite bands today. When we were 17, um, me and all my friends got into Misery Signals and at that point it was all over. Um, era literally started because we wanted a band that sounded like Misery Signals. We just never heard a band that had vocals like that brutal and intense and then melodic instrumentals that were just that pretty. Like we'd never heard it done to that extreme so well before and it kind of blew our minds. Um, particularly the record Controller is uh, an amazing record. And then that coupled with the influence of Circus Revive and Seosin vocally 
Um, you know, that's how I learned to sing, just driving my car, listening to listening to those to those records. Um, that combination of that influence vocally with the combination of Misery Signals instrumentally was really the impetus for what started ERA and shaped the kind of music we write. Um, so this is off of the Misery Signals record called Mirrors. Um, something was always missing, but it was never you. <laughs> For a song called Fade to Design. That was the first era song we ever recorded and it's not on any releases. Um, it's just a standalone single that you can definitely find on YouTube but uh, this was the first one. <laughs> But uh, one that's always stood out is the main riff in the song Expiate off of our record Neon. <laughs> on our new record are from that song actually, but I particularly like the intro riff. <laughs> particularly just really, really like this riff. Um, 